Brother, your big homie, Big Mike, checking in, Real Talk TV. Hope you guys are having a blessed day so far, man, and thank you for tuning into the video. I appreciate it. Hey, to all of my subscribers, man, my lowest subscribers, thank each and every one of you guys for your undying support, your unwavering support. Thank you all so much, man, for supporting me. I appreciate each and every one of you guys. Like I always say, man, there's no me without you guys, so thank you all so much, man, for that. And if you're not subscribed to the channel, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Do not forget to hit that bell icon, hit that like button, hit me up in the comments, and do not forget to share the videos, y'all. If y'all know somebody out there who can benefit from these topics, you know what I'm saying, definitely share the videos. I would appreciate each and every one of you guys who do that. And shout out to Miss Lori Babb, lastly, man. Shout out to Miss Lori Babb, who just joined my membership. Hey, thank you so much, Lori, for your loyal support. You watch all my videos, you always comment in, you know what I'm saying, you always um, liking the videos, let me know how much you appreciate the topics. So thank you so much, man. God bless you and your family, Lori. I appreciate you from the heart, all right? Oh yeah, one more thing. I just opened up Big Mike Real Talk TV um, on, on Gmail. So if you guys got anything you want to like hit me up, you know what I'm saying, about that you don't want to discuss on YouTube, you know what I'm saying, or you have any video suggestions, I understand that. Hit me up on ask at bigmikerealtalktv.com. Hit me up, email me, and yeah, let's chop it up, man, all right? The link for that is down below, all right? So let's get into it, man. I want to talk to you guys about the power of walking away. If there's anybody in your life that you feel like you got to walk away from, trust me, you are much better off walking away than you are putting up with whatever you're putting up with right now. Whether it comes, whether it's a friendship or whether it's a relationship or whatever the case is, even if it's family, that anybody in your life that's not appreciating you, not showing you the kind of love that you require or the type of treatment that you require, you show so much strength in walking away. It's okay to ask them once or twice, hey, you know, what's going on, or you try to get out of them what you require, and if they're not showing you that, if get up, walk away. Do not continue putting up with that. Because when you stay around any situation that you don't appreciate, you are training this person how to treat you. No matter who it is, you are training them how to treat you. And they don't expect no more than what they're doing. So getting up and walking away shows strength, it shows courage, it shows that you are not needy. You know what I'm saying? You got the strength and your dignity about yourself to do that. So not everybody can do that. You got some people out here, a lot of people actually, who put up with things that they shouldn't be putting up with just for the sake of saying they have somebody around. Listen, I used to be that type of person, man. <laughs> Yo, when I was younger and I was new into dating and things like that, and I was naive and I was green in life. Yeah, I put up with so much things that I shouldn't have put up with because I did not want to be alone. I hated being alone because like I told you guys in another video, when I was alone, I felt like that's when my darkest hours came. I always had these thoughts that would hit me when I'm by myself. And so to keep myself preoccupied, you know, I always had somebody around me. I couldn't stand to be alone. So even when it came to people mistreating me or did things they shouldn't have been doing or saying things to me they shouldn't have been saying, I put up with it because I'm saying to myself, well, this may suck, but it, it's better than being by myself. But the more I continue to grow and mature, and grew to love myself and respect myself on a whole new level, that stopped. I stopped caring about who was around and who wasn't around. You know what I'm saying? If somebody was like, hey, I wanna get up, I wanna leave, I was like, fine, be gone. Because now I'd much rather have my peace than somebody around me that don't appreciate me 100%. Especially when I know I'm giving them my all. So if you're giving somebody your all, man, all your best efforts, you know, if you're telling them you love them, you're showing them you love them, they are not reciprocating that, they're not showing you that they love you in return, Walk away, walk away, and do not be afraid to be alone. Yeah, it sucks for a little while, but you'll get over it, you'll get used to it. And then as you grow older and more mature, more wiser, you will grow to understand that it's much better to have your peace than have anybody around you who's not reciprocating your efforts, who's not showing you the same love in return. So I'm telling y'all, you got to fall in love with yourself though. When you don't love yourself, you put up with anything. You teach people how to treat you. You don't set no standards, you don't set no boundaries, and you expect this person to just treat you differently because you say so? Nah, sometimes you gotta show somebody. You gotta show them. If they're not listening to what you say, get up and walk away and never look back. Because if they really appreciated you, they would've done whatever it took to keep you around without you having to go that far anyway. So do not accept anything from anybody. Stop doing that. I don't care who they are in your life, no matter how much you love them, it is much better to walk away. If you know that whatever they're doing to you, you don't appreciate. It's hurting you more to keep them around than it would be to let them go. Let them go. 
If they appreciated what they had, they would have treated would have, they would have treated that with respect the first time. Or even if you had to correct them, they would have gotten it right. But if they don't get it right, hey, be gone. And no shame in that. Let them go. There's power in walking away. Because a lot of times, when you come to find out, a lot of people don't appreciate what they have until it's gone. But by then, it'll be too late. Because now you don't woke up. You don't realize you don't need whatever they was giving you anymore. And you had the strength and the wherewithal to walk away. That shows a lot of courage, a lot of character, a lot of strength. A lot of, not a lot of people can do that. But, hey, like I say, as you grow to love yourself, you grow wiser and more mature, and you actually have dignity about yourself, you start to develop some of that within your spirit, it's so easy to walk away. Because when you get when you get to a point where you get tired of that, like when you get tired of being tired of being tired of someone not appreciating you, not respecting you, not loving you the way you love them, it becomes so much easier to walk away once you had enough of that. But, you, but maybe you haven't gotten to that point yet, but eventually you will. If you're dealing with an ex, not an ex, but if you're dealing with a girlfriend or a current boyfriend, whatever the case is, or a family member who you're around all the time that's just not showing you the love that you want, I mean, it, it, may, it may be hard right now, but it'll get, trust me, one day when you had enough of enough of enough, it'll get easy. And like I said, a lot of times people don't appreciate what they got until it's gone. But fall in love with yourself. Fall in love with yourself. And when you do, it's going to be so much easier to let somebody go because you start to realize and you have that thing click in your mind like, man, look, it's either them or me. Choose you every single time. That's what they're going to do. So why not do the same? Choose you every single time. It gets easier with time, trust me. All right? <laughs> yeah, man, that's something that I learned throughout my life. And um, I'm glad I'm in that place now where I don't need anybody around me. I, mean, I got my wife and maybe a couple of friends, but like now it's so much easier for me to let somebody go because I had I have so much more love for myself than I used to. When I was young and a knucklehead out there in the streets, I didn't care about nothing. I didn't care about life itself. But now that I have grown to appreciate life more, appreciate myself more, things I accomplish and whatnot, man, look, I put in too much work in my life to deal with somebody who ain't gonna appreciate me. I've been through too much. Don't you feel the same? You've been through too much, man. Stop tolerating that stuff if you don't have to. There's power in walking the way. Exercise it. But yeah, that's all I got in the video, man. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And like I said, if you guys want to hit me up on my email, ask at bigmikerealtalktv.com. That's my Gmail. Hit me up, man. Let's chop it up. If you got something you want to holler at me about, any video suggestions, do not hesitate to reach out to me, all right? Don't forget to join the membership. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. But yeah, man, until next time, y'all be blessed. Take care. I love you guys, man. This is Big Brother, your big homie, Big Mike, checking out, man. Peace.